am Danielle Valiente with Atmosphere Salon and our question is, what is the difference between hair painting and highlighting? Hair painting is a more freehand process than highlighting. So just taking a little bit of the product on the tip of your brush and holding the hair elevated and just painting the product onto the hair. So what that does when you're painting it is it ends up giving the, where the product starts, a more subtle dissolved line to create more of a gradient effect or an ombre effect. And you can continue to paint the product all the way through to the ends getting heavier at the very bottom so that the product is heavier in the bottom area, which will cause the hair to naturally get lighter and lighter. So the process of painting is really just that. There's no rhyme or reason necessarily to it, but what you want to focus on is a more dissolved line leading up into the base of the hair. You can go up as high as you want to. That's your choice based on the results that you're looking for, but it's more of just a freehand style. So the difference with highlighting is you would take your slice and then weave with the rat tail comb, just taking out little pieces. The sizes of the pieces are just going to depend on the desired end result. And then a foil is placed underneath. You take your product, apply the product to a quarter inch from the foil line, working the product onto the hair. So with highlighting, as I'm doing here, you're getting way more coverage. Your blonde or your highlights are going higher up to the scalp area, as opposed to when you're painting, it's more freehand with a more dissolved line and then you just place a foil over. So you'll have the hair underneath that will be left out that is the natural color or color that you're putting color on, and then you'll have the pieces that you've placed in the foil packet to highlight. That's the difference between foil highlighting and hair painting. And I'm Danielle Valiente with Atmosphere Salon.